traffic headaches this weekend in downtown Denver because thousands of runners are going to be enjoying the Colfax Marathon. They are, not us. <laughs> I won't make Jim it this Hooley, year. No, Jim Hooley live with a very excited <laughs> runner this morning. And, and Jim, is this someone we just might know? Yeah, yes, def definitely indeed. It's not me. I can guarantee you that, Kim. I'm not going to do that. Those running days for me, those big 26.2, that is over. 17,000 people over will be down here in downtown Denver. They're going to run all the way, believe it or not, from City Park out to Aurora, over to the west in Lakewood, then back to Denver once again. You know, we're right here. We want to show you some of the electronic billboards that they have up there. See that right there? That's one of the warnings about Colfax being shut down during some of the time from like 3 o'clock in the morning until 1 o'clock or so in the afternoon. And this intersection right here at Colfax and Spear, this is where you want to avoid, they say, pretty much for the entire day on Sunday because there's just going to be so many people, including one of our very own, our Channel 2 family member, Jackie Thrapp right here. Hello. Good morning, Jackie. Jackie's getting ready to run the 26.2 and you've been training for how long? Five months. Five months training and I'm ready. You are ready? Oh, yes. Oh, come on. Okay. I don't, are you ever really okay. ready to run 26 miles? No, so, I'm not. So have you shut down running though now? I mean, are you taking a break, a rest before Sunday? Yes, I've had about a good week's break. I had a soda this morning. Probably another soda tomorrow morning. I'm adding in the junk food, and I know I shouldn't because it's going to mess you gotta me get up. In that, you got to get into that junk food thing a little bit, yeah. And you know, we have some pictures of you as you ran last year. You ran the half marathon? Uh-huh. I did the half last year, and my favorite part about that half is people have just the craziest, craziest signs. You're probably going to see some of them going across the screen now, and that's my favorite thing. People are crazy, and clearly I am because I'm doing a marathon. And I, I even you, yeah, I know you love to run too. And there's a there we got the medal here, of course, of the 13.1. That's from last year. And they're doing a really cool thing this year too. You'll be able to track your run on Twitter, right? Yes. And so if you follow me, Jacqueline Thrapp, it's a hard name, T H R A P P. It, they're going to tell you where I am, how fast I'm going. So I'll probably be there the whole six hours because I'm slow. That is incredible technology. Six hours, hey, just finish, okay, and make sure you do it all right. And, of course, Sunday is also another very special day in your life. It's my birthday. Oh, my God. I Running know. Running 26 miles on your birthday. I know. My dear, most people will be home celebrating, doing something, drinking champagne. You're going to be running. <laughs> well, I think they, I think there might be beer after. I know there's ribs and there's barbecue, and you, I love my barbecue. No, don't think about that beer. You definitely have that, but at least one afterwards. Jackie Trapp, way to go. I'm Channel 2, 5 a.m. producer. She's, look at her, she's off already. You can't tie that woman down. She is ready to go. 17,000 other runners will be down here on Sunday. It will be a great time in downtown Denver and all across the metro area. Jim Hooley, Channel 2 News, Daybreak. Let's hope it's 26.2 miles. I know the Colfax Marathon one year came in a little long. Oh, so, uh, measurement, yeah. <laughs> you you want to don't it's, stretch it out for people. It's, it's, it's long enough as it is. Thanks, Jim, and good yeah. luck to Jackie. Yeah, good luck. She seems so excited. All right, coming up, the Rockies ended that losing streak.